We live? I think we live. I think we survive. I think we're here with power and strength. Yeah, no, actually, we are here. Let's go. Hey, what's up, everybody? Hello, welcome. Welcome to the third and final major Mechabellum stream on the YouTube channel. Uh, let me make this very, very clear. Sex. That is all. Uh, welcome to the uh, to the third major Megabellum stream. Um, as you all know, I, uh, I had lost almost every single game of the last um, the last uh, stream, and that wasn't very good. That was very bad. I was quite bad. Um, so today we're gonna try and fix that. We're going to do our very best to not lose every single game I possibly can. While you are all up here at uh, 7.46 uh, a.m., which is a crazy time frame this, this early in the morning to be streaming. But uh, this weekend, I'm basically going incognito for a bit. I've got a whole weekend plan with some friends and stuff, so I am trying to take a break and relax because I am uh, fucking dying uh, so yeah, um, I, I talked about that on Twitter a bit ago, uh, and, and Twitter is the hell website, but it is, it is what it, what it is, so, you know, it's fine. Don't worry about it. I, I know a lot of you are probably, like, uh, in the UK or whatever or something, and that's, you know, that's fine, whatever, you, you are where you are right there. Um, hello to the European fans, uh, I make fun of you all the time because... I'm American, and you have all the ability to make fun of me. Okay. I want to see what we can do to adjust our tanks. I like the idea. This might sound crazy, but I want to go into... I want to see what we can make in terms of just high-damaging sledges. Very high. So I was talking with someone in chat earlier. Mechanical rage and range enhancement sledges. Because uh, the range going from 95 to 135 is actually a pretty phenomenal range buff. I mean, what even has 135? Arclight has uh, 90. Uh, Stormcallers have 180, of course. And, and Marksmen obviously have a lot. They've got 140. But it's about the same range as a Marksman. Melting points, 115. Fortress is 100. Even the Phoenix isn't that long. Uh, but, you know, they can't shoot air, so it doesn't really matter. Um, I thought it'd be kind of an interesting little thing there. So I, I want to try it out. Uh, thank you for the... Um, thank you for stopping by, though, uh, uh, everybody. I, I really appreciate your support. Um, I'm a little iffy on the whole YouTube streaming thing. It's something I want to try out, but I, I'm... My schedule right now is just so broken. I, I am, I think I'm. Fi I finally realized that I've I've reached a certain level of burnout, and it's I can't really keep this going for very long. Uh, so I'm trying to work on getting some help. Um, not like therapy, though. There's nothing wrong with that. Uh, like assistance and stuff. Um, to kind of take a little bit of uh, of the pain off my uh, off my back. Uh, but um, yeah, I'm tr I'm trying to figure out exactly how to get this all done, but. Anyway, sorry, I, I'm, I'm kind of going on a tangent. Um, I kind of want to go with a wacky melting point build. Armor. I want to try the electromagnetic barrage because it's pretty good, too. You got the editors? I do have I do have editors. Ed editors help, but you can't edit a stream, you know? Also, like, you got to remember all this other stuff I'm doing. So there's, like... There's the major uh, green screen channel videos that have I need to write a script for and film uh, footage for, of course. And those take a very long time to make because they're, you know, just there's a lot going on. Then there's all the second channel stuff. Then there's the Twitch stream. Then there's my attempt at YouTube streaming. Then there's Adeptus Ridiculous. Then there's the Orchidate merchandise site. Now I'm taking over Dice Check. And there's all personal life stuff. And then there's all the background shit like emails, sponsors, uh, and discussions with everyone else. I need an assistance. Very fucking badly. <laughs> so, I, uh, I'm working on that. You know what? I kind of had this idea. What if 
Like, like, what are our thoughts on Photon Emission Boat? I, I think Photon Emission is, is a bit, like, underrated myself. And you can, because we might take Boat as a dip. We're looking as Boat as, like, a major weapon. But I think we should be looking at, at Boat differently. We should be looking at, at Boat as a support platform a little bit, you know? So I'm kind of thinking about that. Um, yeah. Wait, what the hell is Rocket Punch? Fortress launches his fist to attack enemies, triggering once when Fortress's HP is below 70% and 40% respectively. The range of Rocket Punch is 180 meters, causing 1500 damage to a target enemies within 25 meters of the target. The damage of Rocket Punch increases to 1500 per unit level. Oh my God. Wait, that sounds so much fun. Oh, I'm out of technology points. That's right, because I bought everything else. Crap. Oh well. <laughs> that... <laughs> that... <laughs> oh man, I love... I love the old, you know, early 2000s meme stuff. That's hilarious. Okay. Um, heavy armor, quick supply. Marksman or speed? I'm gonna go with heavy armor balls because it might survive against early marksmen. It's not marksmen, but it is arc lights. Okay, he has phoenixes. So I am definitely going to need anti air. Based on what he has, marksmen seem to be the play. So let's go ahead and drop some balls up in the front. And then we will drop the crawlers here. I'm going to put like a crawler unit maybe like here-ish. to Because I don't... There's the possibility that the um, phoenixes... No, he'll put the phoenixes in the back probably. Let's grab the marksman. We'll put them kind of close up. Eh, maybe a little bit farther back. They move so slow, though. We'll try that out. We need anti-air. Okay, here come... Okay, he built crawlers and arcs. Oh, sorry, he built crawlers is what I meant to say. Okay, so we're, we're going to be pretty good on the... On the front line, I think we'll, we'll be okay. Oh, no. Maybe we won't be good. I'm actually a little surprised the right side didn't make it. I thought they would make it. Hmm. Damn. Ball, balls don't do anti-horde very well. Okay. Holy shit, Elite Crawler. You know, I'm actually... Someone mentioned Storm Callers, and I think I actually might need to agree. His front line was held back for a very long time. Okay, he went, and the storm callers will definitely kill elite, uh, or a level five crawlers in one shot. So, oh, he didn't. I don't know if they'll survive long enough, though. No, they won't. The crawlers just ate it up, and the crawlers are too fast, which means I'm going to need more frontline chaff. Damn. 
Damn. Hmm. <laughs> Subsidized storm caller. <laughs> Assault fortress actually looks pretty good. But I don't need a fortress for this right now. I don't, you know, the Phoenix, he's got too much anti-air. I think I'm going to go with some Stangs. I'm going to put him kind of in the back. He also built storm collars. I did not expect that. Holy shit, those level five crawlers are more than I expected. Good God, those those crawlers are going hard. You know, I don't know. I feel like going harder into ground might be the bad idea because he's got so much air. I'm not going to lie. I kind of want Heavy Hacker. You know what? This might be stupid, but I kind of want Heavy Hacker. I'm going to try out Heavy Hacker. I'm going to go Heavy Hacker, and I'm going to do the multiple control to start with to try to take over all of his crawlers. His crawlers just got Replicate and Mechanical Rage. No, never mind. That's subterranean bullets, not replicate. Well, even the better ver the 500 HP hacker did fucking nothing. Holy shit. I didn't realize how low that range became. Oh my god, it's only 50 meters. Oh fuck, that's really bad. That's really, really bad. I didn't realize it was that bad. Yeah, this game is not, not looking great, but most of my games aren't, so, you know. Ah, uh, we might just need a Vulcan. We'll bring out a Vulcan in hopes of uh, surviving a little longer. Oh, he built so many fucking crawlers. Yep. Oh, thanks for the donation, Quirky Quirk. Hey, Berkey, if you should host a tournament, and if you do, can I cast? No and no. That's incredibly random. Oh, God. That's going to be the heavy tungsten, isn't it? Oh, that's one of the 300 missile. Oh, he's got Wasp Swarm, though. Oh, yeah, I'm definitely fucked with the Wasp Swarm. 
Oh my god, he he put his fucking crawlers in the back line. Holy shit. The Vulcan can't even handle the crawlers. That's when you know shit's screwed. It's when the Vulcan can't even handle the crawlers. That's when you know you're fucked. Damn. All right. Well, that's that, that's GG anyway. Every uh, every attempt I made to to counter one of his things didn't even end up working. It's like I was hitting a brick wall every time. Yay! I'm losing combat power. I can go back to to people who I'm actually uh, who I'm actually at my skill level, which is lower. Why is this person combat power 142? Why am I being matched with someone with combat power 142? It's weird. All right, check this out. We go aerial specialist because, because big health number. Oh, they added a new MMR in this patch? Oh, well, there's the re there's the answer. Hmm. I mean, he has no air, and I did take Aerial Specialist, so that really would be a perfectly fine thing to run. I hate wasps, though. I think they're fucking terrible. I probably prefer phoenixes more than anything. But he's got a whole lot of chaff, so I don't really want that many phoenixes. I'm going to go with wasps anyway. He built fangs, which would counter my wasps. Hey, Ramflax, thanks for the two bucks. So Jack Nunix, hi, Berkey, uh, love your content, and thank you for introducing me to some of my favorite games, especially Frostpunk. How is your computer cafe coming? My computer cafe? My computer cafe? I don't get it. All right, so my wasps are most likely gonna be chewed the fuck up by those fangs. But I think actually they'll be okay because of the... Oh god, my ground troops are getting annihilated. Which is typical. Stormcallers are very, very good. <clears throat> Astus Lupical. Fun fact for next week. Magnus is supposed to be the leader of the Great Ants, but due to great ease with great painting powers, he rejected the deal. I mean, yeah. That sounds about right. From my Peggle video? Oh, you mean Howie's Game Shack? That wasn't my Game Shack. That was just a Game Shack that I used to go to. It's closed, my guy. It's, that, that, that closed down like years ago. All right. Mechanical rave my, my, uh, rage might be pretty good, but the storm callers are still there and they're still, they're still really powerful and they're hurting me. Because I'm like, I'm going to go like, ooh, mechanical rage. And then I'm literally just going to, they're all just going to die just to, to storm callers. So it's like, why even bother? If anything, I would kind of want to do crawlers so they can run faster and cause them problems. Um, but I guess, 
The sledges do go faster with mechanical rage. You know what? I'll go with the mechanical rage. I'll give it a shot. We'll see how it goes. I'll build one more arc light so it's symmetrical. Hmm. All I did was get portable shields. Bit bizarre. Well, I mean, the sledges are certainly doing the damage that I wanted them to do, but it's not like... They're still hurting a little bit, but it's, it's okay. I'm happy with the, um, the wasp flank, though. I'm going to unlock boat because I have the money to do so. Um, let's see. Uh, do I want to upgrade my wasps? Fuck it, might as well. I'm gonna drop another pair of wasps. I'm not gonna drop them on the flank though. I'm at, I think that now that he knows I have jump drive, he's going to protect this flank. So I'm actually just not going to put the wasps there. Actually, I'm gonna put my wasps right here because I think the rhino might drop. Oh, fuck. It, oh, God, it hits the things themselves. Okay, well, it's a good call, but I've got a bit of a problem. My rhino is tearing shit up in the back, though. He didn't defend his flank, either. Maybe the new MMR is being a bit of a problem, because... I feel like I'm, I'm taking this hand pretty handily, you know? Alright. What can we pick here? Skill... Oh, I want tank production line. Oh, but it's going to cost a lot for those fortresses. I wanted more tanks themselves. All right, well, I'm going to take those wasps that I jump drive and move them to the other flank now. Um, I can't put this on a boat because it has to be ground. Or it does have to be ground, right? It says giant units only, but can it be boat? Hold on. I have to try this. What? All right, sure. <laughs> Fuck it. Who cares? That's actually hilarious. We're air, we're air. This is like the A team movie. We're air dropping tanks. Okay, Fang Spawning Fortress. Got a little missile there. He's not protecting his flank. Bit weird. Bit cringe, isn't it? I mean, if he, if he doesn't keep protecting his flank, then I'm just going to win this. Absolutely hilarious, though, this. Oh, my God. It <laughs> All right. Well, here come the wasps and this whole this match is already won. Look at them go. He you know, I mean, his combat power was really low. He might just not be aware. Which I was not trying me to be mean, but I, I saw it and I, I had 1700, he had 172. It was like an astronomical difference. All right, well, that's what it is. All right. 
Uh, so my tanks with my upgrade have 147 range. Good God. You know what? I'm just going to get the permanent upgrades. Just kind of just hope. Yeah, what is the range specialist have those weird googly eyes? The man's seen some shit. All right, so he put a... He still didn't defend his flank. He built... Two, oh, no, okay, he did kind of defend his flank. He built some fangs on one side. Um, but then he didn't build anything for the other wasps. And that will be GG. You know, Mechanical Rage might actually be uh, a bit underrated on sledges. I think I might need to run that more often. They actually put down a solid amount of damage. Sorry, buddy. Why did you give me plus 90 power for what? I'm not prepared for that. I'm not good enough for that. No, take it back. Take it back. Jesus. Wait. Am I, am I crazy? I just got a notification that said Sleeper gave a $20 super chat, but I don't, I don't see any, I don't see any super chats. They're not, they're not there. Am I being gaslit? Orca, oh my God, it's Orchimedes. It's holy shit, it's fucking Orchimedes. Uh, supers. Yeah, there it is. Huh, that's really bizarre. I don't know why that's there. Um, sleeper. Hey, Bricky, love your content. Quick question. Do you prefer balls or no balls in your hentai? Oh, that's why it was removed. Never mind. Now I understand. Uh, okay, I'm not good enough to do elite specialist. Um, I'm gonna go with, oh, Rhino's low HP though. I'm gonna go with Rhino anyway. Fang and Phoenix feels like a nice start. Well, now I know. Now I'm aware. Thank you, YouTube filter. I appreciate you. I will not answer the question. You can't make me. All right. So sledges and crawlers absolutely murder my fangs. Like, like put them into a grave. So what I'm going to do is... Go arc lights. Protect one side. He went marksman. And he put the crawlers way in the back. Uh, oh, Phoenixes, please slow down. Please slow down, Phoenixes. You're going too fast. Oh, thank God. Okay. Oh, fuck. That's terrible. All right. So... Heavy Mustang actually is pretty good. Oh I. I'm gonna go with the heavy stangs. I 
I feel like I need a little bit of a middle ground for the arcs as well. I'm putting them there. God, I picked the wrong spot. Go get them, Phoenixes. Damn. Well, on the good side of things, I will probably be taking this right side. Uh, my Mustangs are going to all be fucking dead, though. And that's really bad. Mm. Please, Phoenix, kill it. Qu kill it quickly. Thank you. This is, uh, pretty over, but it wasn't the worst thing ever. All right, so I need some Stangs on the other side to deal with that. Luckily, the Stangs on the first side are feeling pretty okay. Uh, okay, I do want that, and I do want this. So now I've got my Rhino. I want them to be able to shoot them, like, immediately. I mean, he's probably going to jump drive it over, and that, that's fine, though. Um, this is kind of a wreckage recycling game with those, uh, with those sledges right there. I'm not going to lie. Though it could also be an arm... Uh, no, it'll probably be more of a photon game as well. No, he can hack that. No, you know what? I'm going to I'm going to put the good rhino here. Put the bad rhino here. And then we'll drop the rhino back. Uh no, we're going to drop it here cuz I don't trust him. No, he put the rhino to the left. So, of course it was an instant the missile there instantly fucked him up. Okay, we killed his rhino, which is good. Unfortunately, we still got that wasp problem. Damn. Because of the airdrop rhino, my stings couldn't kill the wasps fast enough. Uh, maybe... Oh, come on! There we go. It's not a win, but it's close. Oh, thanks, this is an effort. All right. Recruitment cost of arc light. Crawler recruitment. Range upgrade. I'm not feeling any of it. Okay, I'm going to grab that. The damage upgrade for the Stangs. I'm going to grab the Photon Coating. I'm going to drop one more group of Stangs over here and upgrade an Arclight. <sighs> Fuck. This is exactly what I was worried about. I mentioned earlier, I was worried about hackers. 
I literally mentioned it earlier. God damn it. That's always the issue with, uh, that's always the issue with rhinos that when you want to make them a nice front line, they can always just get hacked. And then often, it often is what they, what happens. <laughs> Nuke. Uh, Nuke is fun, but I don't think I, uh, have the power for it. What did I, what did I run? I was rhino specialist, right? You know, I might be able to just take him out with Phoenixes. Might be useful. The Rhino is, is thing is going to be a problem, though. All right, here's an idea. We upgrade the Rhino so much that he can't hack it in time. Ah, shit, he's nuking me. That is a pretty orc thing to do, in fairness. All right, check this out. I'm just gonna keep gaining more and more HP. Well, it's kind of hard to tell if I'm going to be totally fucked, but with the rhino, the rhino being taken, it's it's a bad time. I, I think I need to put crawlers or something in the front. I think if I don't put crawlers in the front, I'm, I'm just kind of like, I'm just totally screwed. Mechanical rage crawlers. And you know what? We'll do a we'll do a backline crawler flank as well to fuck around. He built two boats. He built two boats. Oh, punch the hacker, please. Let's fucking go. Hey, this actually might work. Hey! Hey, hey, let's go! I want Lightning Storm. I'm gonna go for lots of upgrades. Like, upgrades everywhere. In fact, that's literally all I'm gonna do is upgrade everything. And then Lightning Storm this side. Airdrop a Rhino. And I don't really know who I'll, I'll, I'll train you. Fuck it. Hmm. Interesting. Interesting. Uh, 
Okay, tanky sledges is a little scary, but my rhino still might just run in there. He also has the rhino drop, which I'll probably just kill immediately. Ah, he got range upgrade for the hacker. Oh, my rhino destroyed his tower! Oh, shit! Wait. I don't win this, do I? Yeah! Ayo, let's go! Let's fucking go! I didn't expect that at all! I I must I must say the crawlers in front of the rhinos was definitely the play. If without that, I think I would have just just flat out lost. And there's my tech point. Sweet, I can buy the new, uh, new, the new rocket punch. Okay, I'm gonna replace armor enhanced with rocket punch. Okay, that's pretty good, chat. I'm pretty proud of that. I'm, pr I'm feeling pretty good. Okay, 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 okay. This what? That is, that is far too high. That is a, that is way too high of a rank. Rip. Steven Durante says, hey, Brick, you ever see someone spam only one type of unit? Like crawlers? Yeah, I've seen that. They often lose, though. Okay. Um, I'm going to go with aerial specialist again. Steel ball and crawler. Nine K is not a lot. Ooh, it's looking at you and your high fucking castle. Oh, it's gonna show. I'm seventeen hundred. He's almost five times my fucking rank. Eat my ass. Okay. Uh, so air is actually pretty terrible into all these fangs. Um, that being said, I'm going to unlock. I should unlock something, you know. You know, I'm gonna unlock wasps regardless. It's maybe not a great idea, but I think I might just jump drive them over next turn and and you know enjoy the fruits of my labor. I, I might I might just jump drive him to the side and then be like, cool. So he just built more storm collars, which is like you know, with the speed of the of the Oh my god, oh my god, that's so funny. They aim for the crawlers but hit all my balls. I think after destroying the tower, the wasps will be able to uh break through the rest. Because the fangs will obviously kill the wasps really badly, but not if the tower is broken. Actually, these wasps are gonna are definitely gonna be a higher level next turn too. They can kill a lot. Okay, it's pretty good. Pretty good. Ha! More wasps. Screw it. It's 
He might also do a wasp swarm on me though. So I think I'm going to drop more wasps just like right here, just in case. And I'm going to give these crawlers upgrades. He also built wasps. Interesting though. He put them to the far left hand side. He is also borrowing. And he's buying more fangs. Oh, let's go. Let's fucking go. He didn't expect the wasp swarm behind. Oh, I'm just ripping into this. Wasn't you like anti-racial against wasps last stream? All right, my friend, I, I, I think you, what you're asking is if I did not like wasps, because whatever you did type, I'm assuming there's a language barrier because you do not know what you said. <laughs> Make that very clear. You may not quite have realized what you meant to say there. And there's, there's no, no shame. No shame in that. We get it. I get it. It, it happens. I just, I got to say it. All right. All right. Um, so ground is not great, though. I think we could probably just go hard into crawlers. Love your content, Bricky, especially for the K stuff. You're right about this game. It's enthralling. It, it really is enthralling, isn't it? It's how fast, uh, you get addicted to this game is insanity. All right. I'm going to unlock boat just to have it but I'm going to drop more crawlers. I think the crawlers are just, with replicate, might just become a, a huge issue for him. We'll put some backline crawlers to go along with it. And then, you know what, we'll, we'll buff him up. He built a shitload of stangs. And he also put down a, a missile. So rip my side wasps over there, but not rip my wasps on the on the other side i'm probably going to lose though because of the uh wasp spam he has and mustangs but the the crawlers are certainly coming in i actually might win my wasp might take out his wasps just due to him spending too much time killing the crawlers that i am replicating Oh, maybe not. We might not have enough time. The Stangs are about to attack my wasps, too. Oh my god, the, the, the final tower break. That's funny. Not bad, though. Uh, Shadow, try the meme arc light build, Bricky. It's extra damage, elite marksman, and extra range. The idea is you want, like, five high-level arc lights. That would be funny, but probably not. I won't lie, I actually kind of like Boat. Boat with giant health upgrade. And then we move these wasps back because he's obviously going to try to stop them. Thick Boat. We'll put him over there so he doesn't need to deal with the, the Stangs as much. He might rocket me again though, and I do need to be careful for that. He built two stings over here. Yep. Um, oh, I don't have armor. Ah, shit. I actually, I could go like photon emission, but I, I get hit. Oh, there's my, there's the rocket. You know, oh God, two? Barrier Fortress might actually be a, Barrier Fortress might actually be a solid run. Why is he? Oh, 
<laughs> this boat though. That was really funny. The boat definitely needs a bit more gun. These are all five grabs, but I guess I could grab Idris Elba. All right, this might seem stupid, but I kind of like it. Flank Vulcan gang. Oh, speaking of. All right, so after Flag Vulcan, we're going to need some more frontline damage. What about mechanical? What about mechanical rage sledges? So funny once those Vulcans arrive. Hey, what's up, guys? I'm here. Brrr. Oh, the other one's not going to make it, though. Okay, well, I just ripped through the right flank like it was nothing. Unfortunately, I'm not going to be able to rip through much more with the units he's currently fielding. It is pretty hilarious to say to see the uh, Vulcan doing what it's doing, though. <laughs> Burn him up, buddy! The stangs are certainly getting cooked. All right, so, all right, we got a bit of a problem here. Um, <sighs> level three Rhino would actually be pretty good. But, but he has, he has too many wasps and other various uh, aircraft. So I don't think it's worth it. Um, we need some more ground. I won't lie, I kind of like barrier fortresses with AA upgrades. I might need to borrow. I don't need a ton of AA fortresses. The boat's doing pretty good, though. But the boat doesn't have any guns. You know, I'm going to make my wasps a little bit better. And we'll just leave it for now. Ha! The fucking instantaneous melt... The two instantaneous melting points! Two of them! Well, rip his fucking Vulcan. My crawlers are about to murder his melting point, too. Oh, God. Yeah, the fortress was a good call, dude.
I like how that anti-air barrage misses a single wasp. Got him. No, stop the mustangs. All right. That was pretty good. That was pretty good. Fortress is getting can get upgraded, which is lovely. I am going to buy the sell off ability to get rid of the right side Vulcan. And then I think we should go with upgrades. A second Vulcan, huh? Has he not upgraded any of his units? Not a single unit has received an upgrade. How bizarre. He gave the tank production line to the melting point. I might go Mechanical Rage for the next uh, major upgrade for the crawlers and then just make even more crawl. Make even more crawlers. Ah, not quite close enough to get what I was hoping for. Was, oh, he was shooting ground fangs? Oh god, no wonder he's doing no damage. Hmm. Come on, come on, fire again! Damn it. Here's the plan. Triple wasp boat. Spam the wasps. Get the wasps out there. Cause problems. Legalize murder. that old movie the old like drag queen movie where it was like legalize murder kill everyone i forget what movie that is big zap pink flamingo thank you chat thank you i knew like a couple of you would get it
Nothing is ever quite as depressing than the boat. Oh, he bought melting point. He had health upgrades. Oh, uh, that's it. Yep. He, uh, yep. I, I, you know what? That was the upgrade that definitely won that. If, if my boat was able to take them out in the two volleys, that would have, uh, I think they would have taken the tower and rolled over the rest, but, uh, rest in peace. You know, that was actually a pretty good back and forth, though. That wasn't like a terrible just stomp on me. I actually felt pretty okay with that as far as uh, things go. Also, like, man, when's a good time to buy a fortress? Every time I buy one for its barrier, I get body in the following combat. It depends on what you need the fortress for. Sometimes the, people forget that the fortress also has a gigantic fuck off gun on its back that does ungodly damage. So sometimes it's nice if you want to kill something really quickly or, or not quickly, but like one shot something, you know, it's like every time you fire it, a steel ball dies or a sledgehammer dies, you know? Um, but, uh, uh, you know, I, I think Fang, it, it depends. Like the, the fortress is a gigantic upgrade, ma like major upgrade unit. You, you need more chaff. You run uh, fortress with Fangs. You need to take out like groups of wasps and stuff. You run anti-air. Um, barrier helps against things like Vulcans, etc. What is elite marksman on a, on a fortress? That's bizarre. Elite marksman is probably my favorite upgrade in, the, in this game, but not many things have it. At least not everything has it. Hey, Samurai Enjoyer. Thank you for the $10 redos. Okay, I'm not good enough to do Elite Specialist, so uh, let's go with Rhino. Uh, you definitely got me a bit interested in this game, but I'm a bit turned off by their repetitive soundtrack during music. Think the devs have any plans for new music. You know, I, I would agree that the, the soundtrack being the same thing over and over again can get a bit old. Um, that being said, uh, I don't know if they have any plans for new music. My, my assumption is maybe, but if anything, just turn the music off and play your own stuff. You know, it's like a music slider. Ooh, I almost clicked Surrender. Yeah, there's a music volume slider, so. Okay. Well, I need anti-air, no doubt. Thing is, is my options for anti-air aren't great. So I'm actually gonna go with Fangs. The need for symmetry is always very high. I oh, thanks for the... Oh, for some reason I thought I saw a missile coming down. Thanks for the dollar shadow. Upgrades usually don't make much sense in my experience unless you can get at least three of four of the unit uh, down to get a value out of the upgrade. Oh, well, that's somewhat true. I think uh, there's an exception being made for uh, giant units. I think pretty often uh, a giant unit with a single upgrade can actually make a huge difference, like Fang spawning or Barrier Fortress. Like, if I only had one Vulcan and the difference between me winning a flank or losing the flank is extra range, like, I'm going to get it. I think, I think it's a case-by-case -case basis. Like, I, I genuinely think it's just case-by-case. Case. But for the most part, I would agree with you that uh, for the unless you have a lot of it, you probably should not uh, get a, a ton of stuff. Or get a, a ton of upgrades about a lot of things to go with it. I'm going to go Wasp Swarm only because I think he is going to go Wasp Swarm. The Fangs actually did a pretty good job. I think I might keep them up. I probably should put those on the right-hand side. He did go Wasp Swarm. And he built more Wasps. Where did you put his Wasp Swarm? Where do you put it? Where are you putting it? Ah, oh, he also put it in the back. We thought the same thing. 
we both were worried for the same reasons. Fangs are underappreciated. Fangs will fucking rip. I'm actually, I, I really should be taking Ignite off though. I should not have Ignite. I should have Mechanical Rage. But like, watch. This unit of Fangs is gonna kill all these wasps. Or I guess it's two units of Fangs. Okay, I lied. I lied. They're very good, but they're not as good as I thought they were. I was wrong. They did not kill all the wasps. I see you rotate storm collars a lot when you use them. Is there a particular reason slash strategy behind that? Uh, I believe that if you rotate the storm collars, um, they fire their missiles in a different sequence uh, because it'll be more staggered and that'll give you a better chance of hitting what you want, what you're trying to hit. Because if they're all uh, like this and they all fire at the same time and they all miss, then you're gonna just constantly miss and it's gonna be a problem. All right, so I'm definitely gonna lose this one because of the turret, the tower, but yeah. How do I keep Fangs alive versus Vulcans? Oh, you don't. I like my Fangs a lot, but the moment a Vulcan comes out, you're pretty much done. I actually think range would be really good here. Oh yeah, that's right, I got a Rhino. <laughs> Um, let's go put him right in front of the crawlers. Let him start tanking stuff. You know, with the amount of wasps he has and crawlers, I'm actually going to buy armor enhancement. I'm going to swap them. Yeah, because wasps do, what, 189 damage? Yeah. This is going to make this wasp, like, ludicrously tanky. Oh, shit. He put... He, or, uh, this rhino, like, ludicrously tanky. It wasn't as tanky as I thought it would be. I, I was wrong. I'm actually about to lose both my turrets, too. Well, that's not good. Ugh. Know how much I don't like running stings. Oh, Ion. Oh, he also gave himself uh, the uh, shield. Whoa. The power, truly. It's fine though, his stang, his wasps are going to get eaten alive. Because Mustangs are OP! As I've said a million times over. I didn't actually know this is Arclays. Wow, both Mustangs got a, uh... Ooh, I like Orbital Javelin. It's really good against certain units. I forget how long it takes for it to arrive, though. I'm gonna try to hit his hit his wasps. All right. Uh, he's only got two arc lights. 
I mean, honestly, more fangs might actually be good. Just to kind of get some on mass. Nah, wreckage recycling. Wreckage recycling and two more fangs. He really likes his wasps. He built sledgehammer flanks. I, there, this man is an enigma. And then he's wasping me. Well, at least the wasps will die to the fangs. He built level two sledges for the back line. All right, so one flank is going to be fine. My other flank is about to have problems. She. I, my, dude, my brain cannot comprehend this person. My brain cannot comprehend this person. I... He's too smart for me. I am going to waft swarm this side. Drop some more fangs on this side to help with the problem. I'm going to borrow, increase my attack, and then drop even more fangs. Fuck, he went with hacker. I am so screwed. Oh, wow, my wasps didn't even survive on the side. He upgraded his sledges? I don't get this guy, man. He's, he's doing such wacky shit. Oh, oh shit, I died. Oh, because he stole my rhino and that swapped it over, which means I took the damage from him. Oh, crap. He took the rhino, which which made it go to my damage. Shit, I lost to a McNugget. Damn. Damn. You're right. I, I How could I have possibly ever... I, I did not expect goddamn upgraded sledge flank. That's so bizarre. Um, let's see here. Uh, Jonathan Lowridge. Yes, the, the Zaro Telemi and boarding action thing was really, was honestly like a top three part of the trilogy. Ricky, are you winning? No. No, no fire Mobius. I'm not winning. Revenant. Hey, Ricky, since you're really into Elden Ring and you like mechs, are you interested in Armor Core 6? I don't know if I got really into Elden Ring, but I am, yes, interested in, in Armored Core 6. Because unlike the rest of you, I actually played Armored Core. Listen, most of you Armored Core fans have never fucking played an Armored Core game. What is that image? What is that image? All right. 
If it, that is true, if it's stupid and it works, then, you know, if it's stupid and it works... Alright. Speed specialist. I wanna go fast. No, I played, uh, I played Armor Core 2. Uh, 2 Silent Line, I think is what it's called. 3, 4... I think there's also another two called like Ace Assault or something like that, and then and then that's where I kind of uh, petered out. So my fangs move nine now with the extra speed. Uh, this is actually perfectly fine crawler run, I think. Um, I honestly think the crawlers. And the fangs will do uh, just nicely. Symmetry. We must have symmetry. Bada bing. He put side crawlers. Okay, okay. Interesting. Not what I expected. My honest reaction to you playing Disco Elysium was oh god, he is going to be tormented. Tormented in what way? The game is going to torment me or people are going to torment me because I'm playing the game? Because I keep I keep the, the chat in emote only so I don't get... Have, I don't have those issues. I mean, I won't lie. Disco Elysium might have the most pathetic protagonist I have ever seen. And that's pretty cool. I mean, that, that, that's like kind of awesome. Go get him. I, mean, I, I win this one, but barely. Would you recommend trying to play any of the previous Armored Cores? Probably not. The new one looks a little different, so... Also, some of those old Armored Cores are really showing their age. Also, uh, Ar Armored Core is one of those games that weeds out people who can't handle it pretty quickly. Uh, that, that's not a flex on myself. I wasn't very good at the game at all, but... Playing Armored Core, you'll be like, wow, this is a lot. Oh, fuck yeah. Level three fangs. Let's fucking go. Yeah, Armored Core has always been particularly niche. He also bought level 3 fangs. I don't blame him. But yeah, Armored Core has always been a pretty niche, I'd say. Uh, I'm assuming that they're going to be a little bit less niche in the coming, um, you know, the next iteration. But uh, we'll see. All fangs and artillery, the Imperial Guard way. That's not the Imperial Guard way. We need way more sledgehammers for it to be the Imperial Guard way. The new armor core seems slower, made to attract Souls players. I wouldn't say made to attract Souls players, but I would say maybe is attempting to uh, uh, gain the audience of some of the Soul Like, Well, I guess it's kind of the same thing. Um, I, I don't think it's going to be like a Souls game. I think it might be a little bit easier for people to play uh, overall. Like, like, it'll be more accessible. It'll be more accessible. That's what I'm going. Also, I mean, Armored Core 4 and stuff were really fast, but I don't remember Armored Core 2 being a very hyper-speedy game. I remember it being actually rather, like, well, not methodical, but I, I think the, the recent Armored Cores were the ones that were really like, go, 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 you know? I, I don't remember 3 and 2 being particularly, uh, like, crazy, you know? You, you, you. 
Go get him, Fangs. Hut, two, three, four. Hut, two, three, four. Marine Corps, Marine Corps. Ooh, rah, ooh, rah. Let's go. Holy shit, it's him. It's the Big Meatus. What a name. What a goddamn name. Um, Improved Overlord sounds kind of cool. I won't lie. I kind of want that. Oh, he's too expensive, though. I'll, I'll recruit it, and then I'll go from there. Mechanical Rage Fangs. Let's go. Have you ever considered the long-range field of Stormcaller's meme strat? Also, never thought I'd enjoy a game like this. Thanks for everything, man. Oh, thank you. I'm glad you enjoy it. Um, long-range Stormcaller's. I, you know, crazy enough, I think Stormcaller's are... God damn it. I think Stormcaller's are a bit a bit too strong. Um, I never thought I'd say that, but the more I use Stormcaller's, the more I'm like, oh, these guys look really good. These guys feel really good. These guys might be a little too good. Um, but they're, uh, I, I haven't used like a major strategy mostly involving them because I find them a little boring, I guess. Yeah, I'm gonna, yeah, I'm gonna need shields if he's gonna keep throwing these missiles out like that. Especially because they basically one shot my guys. Though I think I still win this. Mechanical Rage Fangs are fucking moving. Well, mostly moving. They also are doing a lot of damage now. Get them, crawlers. Yes. Look at them go. Look at their look at the little legs. They're moving at 14. That's quite quite quick. Alright. Uh ooh. I want recruitment cost of non-giant units. I literally just got a boat to do all that stuff, and I didn't even- I'm not even gonna use the boat. Alright, so I am gonna need shields. I'm gonna put this here as like a early distraction. Hey, Jonathan Luridge. Man, you've been getting me through a... Oh, shit. A really tough time uh, being unemployed with your 40k and other content. Got offered a great job today. Thanks, dude. Oh, hey, congratulations. Very happy to hear that you, you're finding yourself a gig. That's very, very good to hear. And thank you for the support also. All right, so that's pretty good on that part. The downside is this Vulcan is going to just just destroy me, you know? Um, oh, damn, my fangs left the, the bubble. Why did you leave the bubble of safety? Why did you leave it? Why? Why did you set me on fire, SpongeBob? Why couldn't you have just finished your essay? Holy fuck those fangs, though. We're getting boat. We're gonna borrow to get mothership boat. We are going to put another barrier down. Boat gang! We love casting boats. Yeah, level two Vulcan is, is going to be a bit of a problem, I'm not gonna lie. making me a bit sus. You know, I didn't assume stream sniping to start with, but that's that's pretty sus, I'm not gonna lie. There is no reason he would ever build a melting point. 
He is, and not only that, but he also put it on the same side as the boat. It's a bit sus. I, I, I don't normally like the whole uh, stream sniping thing because I think a lot of streamers use that as just an excuse for them being bad. Um, but I, but I gotta be honest, that was, that one was pretty sus. It's pretty sus. All right. Well. Oh well. You know what actually would be kind of fun? Actually, I, I was gonna say sledgehammers, but steel balls with extra fifty percent attack, HP, and movement. It has increased his recruitment cost by fifty, but I actually um, decrease it by fifty as well because of the the thing. Oh, I need... Ah, oh, crap, I screwed up. I need something to deal with the back line flank. We'll drop some more fangs. Photon. Ah, crap. The balls would go over there, wouldn't they? Yeah, that photon made it really hard to handle. And the phoenixes, too. Mm, but Boats is, uh... Oh, he's gonna fire at the fucking fangs, man. God damn it. Of course he's gonna fire at the fangs. They did take out the melting point, though. I don't really know what to do. I could just get more ball. Ooh. I actually do like the idea of the photon emission on the boat. That, mo that actually would be really helpful. I'm gonna try this. He got energy diffraction and range enhancement. That's very weird. Okay. Well, the, the the turret takedown is pretty good, or the the tower takedown is pretty good. Though I'm about to lose my t oh, I got the Vulcan. I should have this though. I should get the the fangs of the wasps will deal with the, uh, the phoenixes or just the boat. All right, that's good. I'm going to take another boat and put it over here.
and get more balls. I'm gonna go with slightly more attack damage on these, uh, on these storm callers. And real quick, I'm just gonna, I'm, I'm sick of these guys over back here. I'm just gonna hit them with the bomb. Da bomba. I'm gonna, I'm gonna look over here just in case. everywhere it's all gone ah oh, the frames Honestly, don't know exactly what happened there or how I could have stopped it. Oh, he's got the flaming Vulcan thing. Mmm. That makes a big difference. I think I do need shields. All right, we're going for the big bucks. I actually don't know really where to put them. I don't think he should go in the front because I think then the uh, the melting point will kill him. I'm going to put him over here. But I need him to be close enough to... All right, you know what? We're going to put him, put him up there. I mean, it's, uh... Oh, he gave him... He, gave, he got the heal. Okay, there's only one answer now. If I even survive this is, um... We, we need Electro. We need Electromagnetic Marksman, like ASAP. If I even live, I don't think I'm gonna live though. I'm gonna lose 800, like 200, or like 1100. Oh no, I'll live, okay. We, we need electromagnetic marksmen, like bad. Go with a whole bunch of upgrades and pray. All right. <sighs> Here we go, everyone.
What a very specific spot to photon coat. Well, that's the end of that. It did not work. Yeah. It did not work. Plus the extra Vulcan. Yeah. Oh, well, it was a valiant effort. A little sussy, but I don't think I've got enough reason to, to really uh, to confirm anything. So a little sus, but it's all right. It is what it is. Very, oh wait, wait, hold on. Uh, let's see here. Uh, Brandon Barr, no, Dr. Plasma, thanks for the $5. Appreciate it very, very much. Brandon Barr, hey, Brick, you wanna say thanks for all the entertaining videos. You've helped me through a pretty rough patch recently and it's nice to have someone to keep my mind off of all of it. I mean, that's, that's most of the time the goal is to just keep things out of your brain, you know? Uh, and then Ab the Man, thanks the ten dollars. Have you seen the YouTube video of Al Mr. A M Mr. Crab singing Eminem's song without me? Nope. Nope. I don't know if I need to either. Giant specialist, big money. Wait, the guy has 126 power? Oh, I didn't even notice. Now, I'm not saying we turn one Vulcan. I'm just saying. Marksman was not actually a bad pick. Level two. Oh, right, because uh, elite specialist. Duh. Yeah, so this will this will be one of those classic cases of I, I rip his other flank apart, but uh, then um, you know, move over and kill him this way. Look at them go, look at the crawlers go. Hundred, just like that. Okay, Nano Repair Kit did sound amazing, but I mean, can I? Can I? It's fifty cost, fifty cost to gain supply specialist. Like that. That's kind of insane. I have like no money right now, but that's because I borrowed. Damn it, Phoenixes. Really, though, he spent $100 on that? That's kind of a little surprising. I 
I mean, it works, no doubt, but like, it, it just feels a little bit uh, bizarre as a choice. By golly, you you know you you know he trying, you know he trying. All right, level three fangs would actually do pretty good. I'm gonna take it. Oh, I'm stupid. I made a dumb, dumb move. Uh, bada bing. And... Let's see. Let's go to back backline crawlers. And we'll go from there. Okay, he built arcs. Kind of hilarious, though. So, um... I mean, obviously, I'll lose this fight. He, he, built, he built a singular arc over there. You know, I, I really want to run um, more sledgehammers right now, but with the phoenixes, it's kind of just not a great idea. Look at him go. Look at that Vulcan go. Look at his power. Look at his presence. Damn. Uh, ooh, I might. Uh. No, he's gonna kill the other tower. No, I'm gonna lose because he's gonna kill both towers. Oh, what is this pathing? Oh, God. Oh, God. At least the shield's down. All right. Boop, 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 boop. Tiny little, tiny little boops. Subsidize arc light, mass produce wasp. I'm not gonna lie, actually, mass producing wasps might actually be really handy. Yo, the wasp gang. All right, what did he get? He took giant hunter. Okay, he took giant hunter, so I'm probably not gonna run any more giants. Um, I'm going to grab Mechanical Rage on my sledges, and then, uh, HP. He got range on his arc lights. Not quite what I expected, but okay. Well, he did buy a few more of them. Go get them, wasps! Go get them! I like how the wasps are dying practically to a level two fucking... Oh, God. Oh, God. Mustangs, again, just tear everything I know and love apart. I don't want to build any more giants because he took giant hunter. Oh, no, that won't matter. I'll just die before I can even get in range because wasps are terrible. These wasps fucking suck. Also, I, I did get the worst wasps, though, so there's also that. Um, I actually like movement speed. It's actually, I, you know, I, I think I just want to go with more, uh, more sledges.
they've been uh, proving me, proving to be pretty good. Crawlers aren't a very good option because they tend to die too quickly. But w okay, what if I were to buy fast food and disguise as my own cooking? No memes aside, I'm actually gonna mechanical rage my crawlers. Stupid, maybe. Possibly useful, also maybe. God, the stangs just kill everything. Uh, okay, well, I believe... Oh, no, I might actually win if I can take out that phoenix with these fangs. Oh, I did win. Holy shit, I didn't expect that. Thunk. I'm just going to buy that and give it to the Vulcan. Remember what I said in my video about sledges? It's like a revolver. It's not the greatest tool for the job all the time, but it's reliable. This Vulcan is actually probably going to rip. Fortress. Oh, right. He's elite specialist. So yeah, level two fortress. I may want stangs of my own. Because the wasps are just like total, total ass right now. Oh, he bought the barrier upgrade. Okay, interesting. Wow, I did like zero damage with the barrier uh, against that barrier. Holy hell. Oh, the crawlers got through. Oh, no, the 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 sledgehammers blew it up. Huh? Didn't see that coming. Okay, I have lost though, but that kind of caught me off guard. What's the range of the Mustangs? 135. What's this give me? One, oh, so maybe 140? Might be worth it. Level three, steel balls. Wait a minute, don't I have the armor upgrade? I'm taking the armor upgrade. You know, I need to counter his flank. I'm just gonna do exactly that because they have a, a massive amount of damage reduction now. I wanted to pick one side that I knew they would be effective in. They're, they're going to blow up pretty badly to uh, the the fortress, but they're, the stangs will do like next to zero damage to them. And that's what I cared about the most is the uh, not being able to be hurt by the stangs. Unfortunately, the balls have decided that the best course of action is to fire at the Mustangs instead of the fucking fortress. God damn it, dude. God damn it. Holy shit, I almost died. God.
Let's go. More balls. backline phoenixes actually you know this might work out the backline phoenixes were taken to go deal with the balls and so the rest of my my group is actually making their way through look at that ah uh, but i am gonna lose because i don't have enough anti-air because he bought a shitload of phoenixes. These, like, three tiny fangs don't have the power. Ah, oh, damn. That sucks. It actually was... It was, like, right there. It was so close. It almost worked. It almost worked. It was this close. It was that close. We were this close to uh, to greatness. You know, I probably should have done more anti-air, though, just in general. I, th I think my lack of anti-air was also a big part of it. Oh, hey, Just Cuz. God damn, that's a big dono. Thanks for the 20 bucks. Damn it, Bricky. Every time, every time you recommend a game, I end up loving it. 42 hours and four days. Great game. Bro, touch grass. And I mean that in the kindest way. 42 hours and four days is a lot of time. That's like, that's like over 10 hours a day, man. God damn. All right, last game. Last game, I'm going aerial so I can get level two boat and laugh. It's actually a, a totally a wasp build here. Normally, I wouldn't go for this uh, look thing, but... Screw it. All right, what do you think he's going to build? I think he's going to build, uh... Don't worry about it, chat. It was just the smallest of Fs. It was the smallest of Fs. Don't worry about it. Dude, we're so back. We're so back. Ah, I can't wait for my wasps that I specifically built, built to deal with him to not deal with him because wasps fucking suck. You love to see it. God, I hate wasps. But I only build them against marksmen often because marksmen are, are such a... Ah. Because marksmen are too good at killing phoenixes.
<laughs> mass produce wasp. Fuck it, fine. Why the hell not? We'll give him an energy shield and we'll build more wasps. They're, they're worse in every way, but they're cheaper now. But the only thing that could kill them was the marksman anyway, so it'll work out. Just Cause gave a super chat, but you probably did something that made it, uh, that made YouTube destroy it. What did you do that made YouTube destroy it? What did you, what did you kill? You did something. Ah, I think you used the word, um, uh, bitch in all caps, and therefore it, it, the thing was like, no, don't do that. But they were the $10 anyway. Insomnia, it, insomnia is a bitch. That is very true. All right, well, my wasps are about to die, uh, just like the, the worst death imaginable to these Mustangs, because that's always what happens. Um... YouTube was like, hey, stop that, you. Hmm. Every time I tell wasps that they suck, my my immediate uh my 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 stream immediately goes down. I think there's some there's something to be said here. Stormcallers are putting in work, though. You're right. But I don't want Stormcallers to be the thing that, that keeps me going. I need more power. In other ways. Do I have range? No, I don't have range. I have Elite Marksman. New idea. Backline elite marksman wasps. He has upgraded his marksman. Okay. And then range upgraded on the marksman. Oh, they gave range upgrades to the goddamn uh They gave range upgrades to the Mustangs. Oh god, we're in a bad we're in bad uh world right now. Dude, the wasps are losing to the Mustangs even when the tower is destroyed. I mean, I know I chose the, the worst version of wasps, but I didn't think it would be like this level, you know? <clears throat> I assumed it wouldn't be like this. Yeah, I think it's time to sledgehammer up, I agree. Ooh, I like intensive training. Uh, I don't want to spend any money on certain things, so I'm just going to upgrade this so I can get it on cooldown quicker. Uh, Barthez, thanks for the donation as well. You didn't have any message to go along with it, but I, I still appreciate it. Thank you. <laughs> All 
All right. Oh, what the hell? Only a couple Mustangs came. Yeah, I was about to say, like, three Mustangs are about to kill my... We're about to kill my entire squad of Wasps. And I gotta be honest, that's just... That's so fucking depressing, man. That's so fucking depressing. The Mustangs are once again killing everything. Chaff and air, and I can't do anything about it. They're even killing the tanks. getting rid of those wasps so I can upgrade these wasps oh I'm I'm actually fucked oh lovely oh how did he get that much money? I know he borrowed, but shit, man. Two boats. Arc lights do not wipe Mustangs like you think they do. The Mustangs have 135 range, and the Marksman will just fucking annihilate the Arc lights. I will take Giant Hunter, though, because I can probably take out those. Uh, hmm. I actually don't really know what to do. Vulcans don't feel very good. Melting points will get taken out by the stangs. Arc lights are just gonna make me not have nearly enough like units. Chaff gets killed too quickly by the stangs. Phoenixes will die to the stangs. Rhinos will die to the boats and the marksmen's. You know what? I actually don't mind the fire on Stormcaller idea. Rhinos aren't that bad, though. Oh, fuck. I don't have much time. Oh, shit. Okay. Fuck, I was running out of time real quick. Yep, that's ex I, exactly what I thought would happen, would happen. Exactly what I fucking thought was gonna happen, happens. The Marksmiths were just going to delete the Rhinos. I think I just lost this game. Every attempt to handle what's been thrown at me is constantly just just r ripping me up. I think that actually is game. Yep, that's game. You know, I mean, considering we won a few games today, it only it's only fair that we get annihilated in the final one. It's only fair that we get annihilated in the final one. Well, you know, on the good side of things, I won't need to, to lose on stream anymore, which is great. I won't need to just show everyone as I die. 
Uh, also, Sarcastic Monkey, thank you so much for the donation. And uh, John, thank you for the donation. And says something. Thank you, Bricky, for being positive and also even in defeat, being a positive gamer. Thank you for censoring the word gamer. I was very worried. YouTube might flag it. Uh, you using the, the hard G word, gamer, in my stream. I feel it. Uh, but yeah, it is it is what it is. We're in the it is what it is era of our lives right now. Uh, but oh well. Hey, you know, we did our best. We tried. All is fine. Uh, that is actually going to be the final Mechabellum stream for a good por period of time. Um, I don't know if I'm going to do another one at any point, but uh, the next video I'm going to be... YouTube does not actually censor gamer. It's a joke. Um, uh, the next video I'm going to do is going to be a, with a game that I am much better at. Much, much, much better at. And it should be a, a hell of a good time in order to uh, to hop onto that one. So uh, we should be uh, be feeling pretty good about all that. Um, so, hey, you can you can doubt it as much as you want, but uh, trust, trust, I, I am better at it. Uh, but yeah, uh, thank you very much for the 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 time. I, I appreciate your your time being here, stopping around. Thank you so much for your support. All things considered, trust the plan. Try exactly try. Chap, trust the plan, okay? If there's anything I've ever learned from... What's that stupid conspiracy theory people think again? If there's anything I've ever learned about QAnon, it's that if I, so long as I keep trusting the plan, I'll keep losing, but I'll be able to justify it. Have a good one.